Must have been a while since you were last activated. What's the last thing you remember? The Oh, I've heard some speak about the Mupani. Who are they? They were creatures. They were the wardens. They were making peace for the land. If we are no longer here, then this world is an emptier place. I will warn them. They deserve better than to vanish. But it seems that they work us on. And you, human, what do you want with me? I need access to the Warden Network. You humans are all the same. You create without a thought. You struggle without a warrant. You expect the rules you leave behind you to forget what you have done to them. I will just watch your kind of tree enemies. How you program them to slaughter and hate their own brethren. It wasn't me. It wasn't us. You see that? Don't you want my servitude? Not servitude, no. I'm asking for your help. What is that that you want? I need to access the city of Bass. I know there's a warden there, but it isn't accessible anymore. My second processor is damaged. Without it, I cannot access the warden network. It is Mubani technology, specific to Warden Guardians. Without one, the Warden Network remains not off. I'm sorry you came all this way for nothing. Find another guardian. It uh, it wasn't using its processor. If we now make this guardian died, the one in trust for days. Hires would feel it. All things would be made. Now we are nothing but scratch, we pillage them and they all together. This was a young guardian. Its eyes still forming. It had not travelled far. Not yet not the wardens. Sorry to hear it was so young, but now it has a second chance to live through you. Yes, that is true. But without an action map, I can relate to last quarter. If you can tell me who what is the boss, I can attempt to allow you a link. Where could I find those coordinates? Yes, I do not know. I am an exes guardian. I maintain the wardens. Bring me the coordinates, and I will link the warden. And to then, the network remains as it is. But 
it is twitching. So it's clearly alive. Yeah, Ollie, you're right. I've only seen one of them when they're inside one of those flay skulls. And that's usually when the skulls are on pieces under my boot. Ozia! I want to ask you about that slingshot you mentioned. Why are you so interested in it, huh? It's not going anywhere, bro. Once you're inside, go talk to Commander Swart. Big part of the lie! Tonight, we're gonna eat something fresh. How did you get past the guards? Speak! I brought the guard a bristle worm and he let me in. I'm going to have those morons killed. You seem harmless enough. Too soft to be dangerous. But you do have the stink of the flay ash on you. I'll be keeping an eye on you. The guards also mentioned something called a slingshot. The slingshot is the only thing keeping away the flame monsters. Those worm bastards were pilfering our children for their parasites for years. Inbred swans can't even have kids of their own. They come out looking like smashed up maggots. Extra limbs, no eyes. So? They come for hours, took the pregnant women, stole crying babies from their cradles, let those parasites crawl into them and take over. The slingshot here keeps the flay out. Vibrations inside it makes their worms go mad, start burrowing deeper into them. Eventually turns their brains into soup. They think we were once the same people. How far they have fallen. Flay and the mongrels were once part of the same tribe. Years ago, yeah. We mongrels are descendants of those who fled to slag from Bars during the Agnet Wars. A mongrel child found an egg buried in the lava fields. The parasite inside was the first of the flay. Their numbers increased, infecting us, spreading. When they started taking babies, we ran. This base was a Bars refugee outpost. The statue there was dragged from the Bars city gates. We found a slingshot in an old agnate base and brought it here where it keeps the fly away from us. We hear its vibrations have even reached their metal city, stopping them from spreading out. I'm sorry your people went through all of that. The slingshot is very important to you. Yeah, but it is failing. Every day the signal is weaker. Every day the signal is weaker. It's failing. We're tired. We don't want to run anymore. We're looking for a more permanent solution. What sort of solution? A weapon. In the lost city of Bars. Our ancestors were building a weapon to deal a final blow to the Agnates. Find us that weapon. Let us destroy the flay and we will not need the slingshot anymore. So you want me to fight an ancient city and commandeer a lost super weapon? And time is wasting. Good luck.
looks like this place is sinking. Access this terminal. The night of the storm, the night when it wasn't what you think, I mean, it was, I was drunk, I needed help, but there was more. I really don't want to relive that night. I know, Marky, I know. I don't want to cause you more pain. But I want you to know that I... I spoke to Charlize just before you came. I was in a dark place. I was going to end it all. I was making one last phone call. I wanted to talk to you, but she picked up. I told her to tell you that I loved you and that I was sorry. She phoned Freddy right after. Told him to look after me, that you would come and get me. I was so alone, Mark. Everybody was gone. Everybody left me. Everyone but you and Charlize. What are you looking for? Forgiveness? No, I don't think that I can ever be forgiven. I just want you to know that I am trying. That I want to be a better man for you, for her.
Whether you want forgiveness or not, you don't need it, Don. It wasn't your fault. Thank you, my brother. <laughs> 